lot of spring chicken. The big news today is, of course, the president says we've got to, oh yes, have another stimulus, increase taxes, so we can get to the business of creating more jobs. So for now, we're going to bring old Cam on with comments on the headlines of today. <laughs> Obama blames Bush and the Republicans' refusal to raise taxes and not allow another stimulus program. I know. This, I mean, they, 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 the guy is just totally and absolutely in another world. The, first, the, the, uh, the Okay, the Einstein definition of insanity is uh, doing the same thing that failed over and over again and expecting a different result. He actually thinks that we didn't spend enough money the last time. If we spend more, it will create an it will result in an eleventh rate, I guess. Oh, really? Yeah, well, they horrible news today. Those small businesses that he needs to create jobs said that they're not going to create jobs as long as he's president. They have flat out this morning said, until this man is no longer president, they will not hire anybody, period. And White House, U.S. is spending $800 million in Pakistan aid. Oh, and uh, they're, you know, they, they said that that's a horrible thing to do because they're not going to assist us if we don't give them money. Well, they're not assisting us now. <laughs> it's a Muslim government, and they basically favor the Taliban, folks. And Facebook set for $1 billion in social gaming revenue. I know. That's basically, I didn't know they were, I mean, I guess they're doing gaming off, but they're charging people to use their stuff. They are. What do you think? That's what they do. Farmville. You can buy, I don't know, fruits and vegetables or... I don't do social. I don't do gaming. I don't know what is. I know you can buy something. I mean, well, here's the big problem: is all the networks are abandoning their web, uh, their web TV series now because they can't figure out how to make any money. So why would you want to invest in gaming when you know gaming is on the backside also? Ooh, now they're talking about gaming being more popular on cell phones than on other devices. Yeah. Well, you know, they've been talking about casual gaming. It's just like to fill in your time. The problem is, it's killing your data plan, and people don't have the money. Oh, Wish that's right. Which they tend right. to forget again. And child dies after choking by electrical cord in New York. Yeah, I, I can't figure out why that's a massive news item. Children die all the time by wrapping things around their throats. It's why you try to keep blankets away from their heads when you cover them up and they're in a bed. And it's all over for the Republicans because they won't raise taxes on millionaires and billionaires. Okay, you know, okay, let's put it this way. A millionaire and billionaire help build the swing set. A millionaire and billionaire help grow the, help plant the grass. Millionaires and billionaires cut the grass. You know, we've got lifeguards behind us that are millionaires and billionaires, according to the President of the United States. Oh. Is anybody who has a worth of over $250,000 a year as a millionaire or a billionaire, which means if you live in California, that's everybody. Mm -hmm. Even the guy working at McDonald's. And NFL retirees file complaint against players and the NFL. Oh, yeah, they're wanting a bigger, they're wanting a bigger check out of the money. Well, no, they, they get their time. What happens is, A lost world, Atlantis like this landscape discovered. It's called, okay, this is called BS. It's like, like, it's, it's like you, you want to hear the new hot thing in television shows? I mean, I love this one. I have family members that are connected to, um, to Stonehenge. They're going to do a reality television series on historical landmarks like Stonehenge and try to come to the real reason why they were built. Uh, Haven't they been talking about that? I mean... Yeah, they know why they were built. I mean... They're going to the Coliseum. What was the real purpose behind the building of the Coliseum? And now they... Is it this all on the History Channel? Why is it a reality series? Because they want to have people come and try to break down the real secret behind them. It's like they, this Stonehenge, this uh, Atlantis thing, is part of that series, folks. Oh. We've discovered it. Could this be the mythical Atlantis? We're going to ask people involved, you know, in a geologist and... And archaeologists, you know, you know, could this be Atlantis? Chavez back in Venezuela for Independence Bash. Well, because they think Chavez is dying. There's a problem now. Oh, really? Of the power play going on. And dozens of kids among missing after boat sinks in Russia. 
Yeah, uh, 140, 150 kids they think drown. Really? Yeah. And Moody says they're not involved in Greek rollover talks. Yeah, well, Greece is defa Greece defaulted. They're having problems coming up with the money for a second bailout now. And Italy is now on the verge of collapse, which means Italy is the third largest economy in Europe, and it's getting ready to fold this week. And two more civilian planes intercepted near Camp David. Well, the problem is, I mean, how big an airspace do you have to have for this president? His airspace seems to be widening every time he goes out. Oh, really? Yeah, I mean, what used to be civilian airspace is now protected airspace because this president above all presidents, because he is America's greatest president, needs to be protected more from the people that love him. Well, well he's unanimously loved by all America. Oh, he is? Yeah, so uh. they have to provide him more protection. To protect him from his lovers. Oh, and Strauss Khan comeback seemed difficult and French divided. Well, you know, he, well, he basically is sensed to be reelected, folks. They're, they're, they had a rally yesterday. We must, you know, this woman is being abused because she's not white. If she was white, they'd have a different system. Well, no, if you're white and you lie to everybody, you get in trouble. Mm. And you find out you got a huge bank account and drug dealers, especially the guys that you claim were raped, raped you to get your ticket into this country or the ones putting money in your bank account. Well... Yeah, they know she lies and uh, they're trying to avoid charging her with perjury and if she keeps pushing it, they're going to throw her in a jail cell. First, they're going to throw her out of the country. That's what's going to happen, so... Well, she might as well just leave. That's right. And anger over Casey Anthony verdict pours out on the web. Oh, God. There, I mean, I mean, first of all, uh, they, I, I love this. A guy got into a fight yesterday because... You know, he basically said, you know, that you know, it's called the justice. You know, everybody has a right to it, so they didn't like it, so they started fighting a bar and threw him in his jail because he was on the wrong side of the verdict. What? He said it's the American justice system showing that everybody has a fair shot, and they basically started to brawl over it. Oh, uh, isn't that why the, what, the symbol for justice has a blindfold on her? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I, I understand that the members of the press were lining up to see which one could be at this execution. Really about that. And Spanish to soon be the national language if Democrats get their way. Yeah, they feel that it's more important that the people of our nation learn Spanish than English. Do you believe that? Mm. School districts are focusing on Spanish and no longer English. And Gaddafi government says in talks, rebels say he must go. Uh, the France has already said that isn't going to happen. They're now talking about ending the war and negotiating after the war is over for, an elect, for a new election. Uh. Because the French government can't afford to put the money up that they were putting in there. Whoever's the new president isn't going to go. Whoever's the new president is going to end the war for them, folks. And Brett Michaels sued over Tony's accident, moved to New York. Oh, yeah. That's where it should have been because it was a New York accident. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. And Union, adequate basis to question NBA financials. Well, okay, first of all, they're losing, they're, they're, lo they, they're lost the battle in the NFL, so they think that they're going to use the same process that the NFL used and come out with a different response with the same judges. Mm. First of all, the game, you know, all these teams lose money. There's a few that make money, but the majority of people that own sports franchise lose money. And New York Stock Exchange shareholders seem embracing D burst merger. Yeah, uh, because what it does, it puts the New York Stock Exchange in the hands of a foreign government, which really makes no sense. They could sell it to the Americans and keep it here, so they're going to sell it to a foreign country. Of course, it's an Obama-approved country, though. Oh, of course. And Treasury secretly weighs options to avert default. Well, the secret option is they're going to let the default happen and let the Republicans raise $1.7 billion in new taxes. They said that the $2 trillion that they want to cut is all going to come out with tax cuts, tax raises, and nothing else. They, Obama won't even consider revising the tax code so that more people are paying their fair share. He only wants those billionaires and billionaires to pay taxes. And I, I loved it this morning. Because of a millionaire and billionaire refusing to pay their fair share of taxes, these people that are planning to send their children to school won't have that $2,000 extra that will be taken out of taxes in their pocket to pay for the, the guy with his airplane. Um, they're not paying taxes to begin with, those people he's talking about. 
Oh, they are? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And a Monty bubble is from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Okay. The rule of thumb is those people that are complaining most about millionaires and billionaires not paying their fair share of taxes are among that 51% that pay no taxes whatsoever from the federal level. What if they paid some taxes? That's why Obama doesn't want the tax code to be written, because everybody would be forced to pay federal taxes. Yeah, everyone. Mm -hmm.